Welcome to the jQuery training videos. In this video, I am going to explain about the clone method. <coughs> so, clone method makes a copy of selected elements, including the chain notes, text, and the attributes. What is the meaning of cloning? We are creating the exact same object with the same features. For example, we are creating the Animal clone means that we are creating the same animal, same type of animal, same type of look. Okay. So, in this clone method, we are creating the selected elements, including the chain notes and the text and the attributes. The syntax for the clone method is the dollar of selector clone within we are passing the two parameters through or false. To specify that the event handles also should be copied. False default is specified that event handler should not be copied. Okay, for example, here I have the one div element, and that div element I have the two paragraphs. I have the two paragraphs, and that paragraph background color is yellow. Run the document once. So on a development and that we have the two paragraphs now i want to create thus i want to clone the same div element so for that purpose dollar dot button sorry dollar button dot click function within the dollar dollar of so i want to clone the div element div dot clone dot clone clone and append to body so this statement close the development after that i want to append that one into to the app end if you do, if you have any doubt about the append to statement watch my previous videos so append to body what is the meaning so our body is copied and appended into the our body element. Now save the document. So save the document here also and run the ones and click on the. Sorry, I did the mistake here. A P P E N D append. So, exact clone is saved and attached appended to the our body. Okay. Now, so what is the meaning of true and false here? So, in the with in the append statement in the clone, we are passing the two arguments. Sir. So, true specifies that event handler handlers also should be copied. So go for the our document how to use the clone method to copy an element including our event event handlers. So the uh, false parameter is a default specifier that the event handlers should not be copied. For first, the first example is I want to uh, append the first paragraph into the my uh, my uh, body tag. So for that purpose, dollar of p clone append to body. So now here observe that here clone append to body clone clone by default value is false. So every by default our 
our page has the two paragraphs now i am clicking on the paragraph it is animated now i am cloning this paragraphs into the our body and uh, append it to the body at the time these paragraphs cloned once lost their event handlers okay animate method so if you are putting the clone of true clone of true so oh, now observe the output refresh the page and clone this one this one also now copied their event handlers so first uh, stop or observe the program dollar of button click function dollar p of clone to append to body clone this document clone the document at the um, and that one is attached to the our body after that the second p dollar of p when our clicking on the p element dollar of this animate font size is plus 1 px so what is what is the use of animate method it increases the font size so font size plus equals to 1 px every time if you are clicking on the paragraph that one is increased their font to size okay like this way we can clone the events event handlers are we can clone the effects special effects of the particular elements thanks for listening